You know what, let's submit that to the game theorist. How fast would Tiny have to spin to be able to hover like that? <laughs> that would be a good episode. <laughs> Let's calculate it out. Oh, I thought she was going to eat it. <laughs> <laughs> Yomp! Boom! <laughs> Welcome back to Rogues and Role Players, everybody. Hello! Where, um, where we have finally reached... Uh, hideout Helm, which is where King K. Rule is supposedly hiding out. So... In the mouth. In the mouth. Whoa, he has his own lava pit? Whoa! Right? He apparently... How did he get lava all the way up here? Well, he is an evil henchman. He's an I evil mean... henchman? <laughs> <laughs> Who does he work for? <laughs> no. Okay, fine. He works for... He works for Bowser, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> No, 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 no. He's got to be on equal terms with Bowser. What? What? <laughs> oh, did we just get a golden banana? The, oh, no. no. Okay. Oh, so okay. There we go. Okay. Uh, why are you invisible? I, I don't know why the invisibility is required for this, but this... Uh, okay. Oh, maybe it's so, like, things won't, like, shoot the crap out of you from the side or something. <laughs> Show! Where'd you go? <laughs> Where'd you go? I need them nanas. <laughs> this dang friggin' shirt and cap are gonna give me a bunch of stuff. Okay, cool. So we got the teleport What was the tab. point of the invisibility? I, I, I don't know. I don't know. Let's just roll with it. Let's just, let's just frickin' roll with oh, it. Oh, maybe it's so he wouldn't see you sneaking in. Oh, so okay. Just taking what nap. is he doing? He's napping. <laughs> oh no, we've been spotted. Oh no. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> 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 oh fuck! It's the Kongs! Wake up, you fools, and activate the machine! Why is everyone napping? <laughs> Get up, you fools! Oh man. <laughs> but it's not, it's not fully tested. It might explode and destroy us all. <laughs> Don't tell me about explosions! That's what it was designed to do! <laughs> Please, Master, just give us a few more hours! No, the time has come. <laughs> Say goodbye to those Kongs. Whoa. Oh, I thought he had like a cool hair like set <laughs> for a second. It was this friggin' uh Here's welding the mask. deal, Kong. The blueprints you you have found um allowed me to block the bl the blastomatics firing sequence for 37 minutes. You must locate and deactivate the machine in that time limit in the main cavern. So, okay, so because of the blueprints we turned in, we now have 37 minutes. Ah, uh, okay. We have 37 minutes to oh, deactivate. Okay, so the final level is time. Yep. Oh yeah, you were telling me earlier in the series that like the blueprints are used for this. So yep. e each blueprint adds like what, probably like a minute? Uh I actually don't know how many they add. I would imagine it would be something like that. It looks like we need Lunky right off yeah, the bat. Yeah, we need Lunky, so or there's going to be Lanky. Dang it. No, I'm doing it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm Lunky! <laughs> <laughs> Is there uh, a... Um, I don't see a switch pad anywhere. Oh, that's not good. A switch barrel, I mean to say. He is big. Ooh. Okay. Oh, there we go. Okay, I didn't see that there. I didn't see All that. Right, nice. Okay, cool. All right. I was like, they would not have done that to us. You no. Enter is tiny, and then... Swap to Chunky to use the invis thing and then get it. That would here. be, yeah, that would be bullshit. All right, let's fucking do this. Nice. So, how does yeah. how does this K rule differ from some of the past like incarnations? I actually like, don't fight wise. If if there's anything you remember, I do not remember the fight with uh, King K rule. So once we enter the fight, I'll actually be kind of just as surprised as you are, to be honest. Okay. So, like I said earlier in the series, I haven't fully beaten this game yet. This will be the first time oh, that I've done right. it. Oh, that's right. So, we, we've we gotten farther than where you stopped last time, right? Well, actually, no. This is... Uh, I, I think the farthest I've gotten was right before the final boss. And ah. So, I've gotten through this before. And then you've never beat the final boss? Yeah, I just never did it. <laughs> I don't know why. I hate it whenever I do stuff like that. Because I did that with Final Fantasy VII because I played it... Like, I think 10 and 10-2 were out at the point when I finally sat down to play Final Fantasy VII. Oh, yeah. Uh, and, like, I got all the way to the end. I got Knights of the Round. I got... Oh, no! No! 
Oh no, is it going to send like, us back to the beginning? The golden chocobo and it all did. that nonsense. So, and then I just like, whenever I got to the final fight with Sephiroth, like, I had already known what happens at the end because I, you know, everybody had already been like, oh, this is such an amazing game, blah, 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 happens. I was just like, I don't really need to fight Sephiroth just because I already know what's going to happen. Yeah. <laughs> blah, 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 Sephiroth, blah, 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 like, end of the world, I feel blah, blah. bad for doing that because it's such, you know, he's such a great character, but it's just kind of like... Eh? <laughs> yeah. Eh? Okay. So, we did not gain any of our time back because we died. Oh, okay. But the stuff that we did before has already been accomplished anyway. Okay. So, it stays so we don't way. have to solve any additional puzzles, we just have to run back. Yep. Just like in Dark Souls. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, except you don't lose all your golden bananas in a giant blood splatter on the floor. Or in the case of Bloodborne, um, taken by the monster that killed you. You know, I, I kind of like that way of handling it a bit better, because then it forces you to kind of get revenge on the guy that kicked your butt. Yeah, I think you and Wade were talking about that in an episode of Dark Souls, um, where it would be cool if instead of just laying on the ground, the monster actually took your souls. Yeah. And I, and I was sitting there like, actually, Bloodborne does that. <laughs> okay, I wonder why they decided not to carry that over. Oh, well. I don't know. Um, but the one exception in that game, though, is bosses. Uh, with a boss, it always drops to the ground. That's gotta be the tiny. There it is, that's the tiny Okay, so barrel. we gotta switch to... We gotta switch, and we gotta find a switch barrel somewhere. I do love the atmosphere in this place. Yeah, it's, it's just... Uh, it's just... I keep, here we are. I keep, like, wanting to, like, do a Doctor Who thing, because every time we go into, like, one of these worlds, even though the, the locale is not nearly big enough to inhabit these worlds... Yeah. It's bigger on the inside. Yeah, exactly. Can you imagine that? A giant floating, like, alligator TARDIS <laughs> to sail the seven seas of time. Yeah, that would be pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> Get on it, Doctor Who. Yeah, what's wrong <laughs> with you? I want to see a giant spinning mecha crone in space. Yes, please. This needs to be a thing. Make this the next episode of Doctor Who. <laughs> see, look, this is even the central console for the freaking TARDIS to yep. activate everything. <laughs> this is the... Okay, so basically basically what's happening is that we are traveling through the TARDIS right now. All right, good to know. <laughs> the depths of the TARDIS and the freaking uh, mechanics bay. Exactly. Welcome everybody to uh, to Doctor Who Kong. Editor Doctor Kong. Editor, I want you to give me Donkey Kong dressed as Doctor Who. Maybe just but like give him give him a piece of every previous Doctor. <laughs> oh jeez. I was just gonna suggest like Doctor Who with a Donkey Kong head. Nope, he's got to have the scarf, the the coat. Uh, I think one of them had a sword. Oh jeez. Uh, <laughs> we gotta have the bow tie and a fez. You do realize that I'm the one editing this, right? Uh, put the bow tie on the fez. Uh, who did we need? Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> Jeez, a bow tie on the fez. Yes. <laughs> so it looks like Genius. a little propeller hat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, do I have to fly through rings? Damn it. Yep. Okay. Uh, there we go. Well, at least we get infinite coconuts. That's yep. So cool. so we just gotta, just gotta do it. But we don't have a lot of time. We've only got 20 seconds, it and I'm struggling. It feels like it's, like, wonkier than earlier. Or are you just having a really hard time controlling it for some reason? Just, uh, it's just wonky controls. Damn it! See, like, I try to aim for it, and it just goes completely around the way it turns. Mm -hmm. Bullshit. See, so you, you kind of have to drift in the air. Yeah. Okay, so where's that switch barrel? Damn it. Why do you need a switch? I thought we had to do that. No, we have. I have to switch to Donkey Kong to activate that minigame. Oh. Yeah, it's bullshit, right? <laughs> no, Donkey. Donkey. Not Lunky. I don't want Lunky. We need Dr. Kong. <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Kong, activate the device. Paging Dr. Kong. Paging Dr. Kong. We have a time crisis. <laughs> Fantastic! <laughs> Because that's his word. He just, yeah, exactly. That's the only word he says, though, and then he just screams like a monkey. <laughs> Fantastic! Ooh, ooh. 
<laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> like, shit, man. <laughs> Don't do that into the microphone. <laughs> okay, here we go. Ah. Fuck it, I'm going for that one. Yeah, just, you gotta... No, damn it, no, please, come on, your... no, 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 come on, hit the... Get the ring, please get the ring. Please stop turning around it. Please get the <laughs> ring and just get into it. Thank you very much. Oh, excuse me, I thought you existed to be flown through. Why aren't you letting me? Yeah, exactly. You're not supposed to be some gravitational pull. Why do these rings seem to have well, some I mean, stars, kind of gravitational pull? Stars do have the capacity to turn into a black hole. Whatever. <laughs> uh, turn! Fucking... So, is it that, like, black holes have, like... There we go, are, like, okay. so dense that they create their own, like, immense gravitational pull, or...? I don't fucking know! I don't know anything about this shit! I'm not a scientist! I don't know what about, oh, there's an infinite universe with a black hole, blah, blah, blah. I don't know this you, shit. You might have known something. That's why I asked. Jeez. <laughs> I was just curious. Jeez. Mm, I want to know about black holes. I can tell... The, there's a freaking point where they they destroy time to where you will be immediately incinerated and also be perfectly preserved forever uh, at the event horizon. What? What? Uh, oh, okay. Uh, what? Okay, this is what. Okay, this is what he was saying. We got to do. We got to destroy these uh, generators. Oh, last, okay. But we got to go in order of one to last, I guess, to get. The K rule door open, I guess. I oh, okay. So we just gotta do them in order then. But we gotta figure out what that order is. Uh, um, let's see. Well, weren't there like numbers on like the doors earlier? There were, but they were on the doors, and uh, after the doors well, open, you know. Oh. Uh, so. Well, I, I would think they would have some kind of marker. Oh man, we're wasting so much time just looking for which doors first. Mm -hmm. This one's got the barrier on it, too. Uh, okay. hmm. Maybe it's in the colors of the rainbow, because the, the, the lasers are color-coded. Hmm. Like, like, in the center, like, the red one would be first. But this one is guarded by the force field, too. It is? Yeah. See? Oh. Well, I tried. <laughs> oh, wow, there's a banana metal in there. That would have oh. been that would have been a way to get banana medals right there if you like we didn't get enough bananas for it. Ah, okay. Um, Man, that banana medal was huge though. Um, we could pay off Cranky's medical bills with that thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Here we go. Okay, I got. Okay. Okay. Donkey pad. Donkey pad. Donkey pad. Donkey pad. Nice. Uh, a pad with a donkey on it. Mm-hmm. But donkey riding a donkey. But before you decide to buy a conga, uh, condo with uh, a burro, uh, we're going to have to finish exploring the rest of this place next time on Rogues and Role Players. Yes, next time on Rogues and Role Players will be... Assaulting Hideout Helm. Yes. With well, our first, burro. I got to play my jams. Yeah. You imagine Woo! that, just having a house with like a donkey in the backyard and you, you call it your donkey pad? <laughs> Just your, it's, it's, it's like another term for a bachelor pad. <laughs> Why do I love it <laughs> so much? Right, wait. Huh? K rule barrel? Oh, well, let's find out next time. Next time. <laughs>